Now in this video we will be discussing about the random walk theory. So what is the basic crux behind this theory is that the past data of the stock that is the present prices or using the past data we cannot predict the future prices of the stock that is the past data cannot be used to predict the future share price of a stock. Now this man was very happy because he have analyzed the past 10 years stock data of company XYZ. So he is expecting that the share price will rise. So what he did, he bought the shares of company XYZ. But what happened after that, what happened in future, the share prices fell down. So the theory is that there is no relationship, there is nothing common between the present stock price or the past data and the future stock price. That is today if the stock price is 100, so if you are thinking to stock price will be 150 or 50, there is no relationship. Now this theory that is random walk theory was given in the year 1953 by the Maurice Kernel. Now he was a British statistician who gave this theory and said that each outcome that is the price of a share is independent. It is independent of past history and he this random walk theory now what is the reason or the name of this theory is based on have you ever seen a drinking person how he walks so his walk is somewhat random that is unpredictable sometimes it will be up down so the walk of this is also random and unpredictable if there is the probability that the stock price will rise then there is the same probability that the stock price will fall that is on the basis of past data you cannot decide what will be happening in the future thank you